For the last couple of days, I've been going through all the students I've ever coached in my e-com mentor career, all right? At this point, it's over like 120, 130, around that number. And I try to find all the commonalities everybody has who actually became successful. And while going through all of the successful students, I've noticed a lot of things which they have in common. And I wanna share that with you right now because while going through it, I actually had a really big realization, all right? So the very first thing I noticed is everybody, and I mean everybody who is actually advanced, only focuses on the fundamentals, all right? There is nothing fancy about anything they're doing differently than the people who are not successful. No fancy strategies, no, nothing is fancy about anything they do, all right? It's super boring, it's super basic, but it works. And that's huge. In reality, there's only three things which are actually important to become successful in dropshipping. Number one, you need to understand what a good product is. That's really important. So what I mean by that is if you see 100 products, you have to identify immediately which one out of these 100 is the best one, all right? That's number one. Number two is making really good ads, okay? Really good ads are gonna be also crucial and everybody who is successful knows how to make good ads or has a very, very good video editor who they outsource it to. All right. And number three is problem solving. And I'm not talking about problem solving products. I'm actually talking about the ability to solve problems by yourself. All right. Every time you face a problem, you need to understand that there's a solution and you need to understand how to go about finding the solution to that problem. All right. And if you have those three things down, you will be successful with dropshipping. It's, it's pretty simple. This is really interesting because the fundamentals are the things which are always there. All right. Every single person who's successful has those three things down, no matter what it is, all right? The other things, like for example, some people are using CBO, some people are using ABO. Some people are using dynamic ad creative, some people are using regular ones. Some people have this theme, some people have that theme. It's different with every single student because those are the elements which can actually switch and which all will make it work. It doesn't really matter. Some things work better here, some things work better there, but in the essence, it's not gonna be that game changer thing. All right, everybody knows how to do those three things, okay? Everybody who's successful. And everybody who was not successful is doing one out of these three things wrong, all right? So it's actually only knowing how to do these three things which will make you successful. So now knowing that, I will ask you a question which you have to ask yourself, all right? What are you doing every single day to get closer to being good at those three things? Probably you're focusing on completely different things, like the store, like fancy tactics to increase the conversion rate, the average order value, all of those things you can do and they will help. But that's too fancy to get started with, all right? You should not get fancy with anything and just stick to the basics. Do everything very, very simple. And this actually applies in every specific area of dropshipping. I mean, even if you're selecting a product, you're not gonna be fancy about that. You only focus on, let's say, five criteria, which you've set for yourself, which that product has to fit, all right? That's how we always do it in the program. I tell you exactly which criteria a product has to fit, and you have to find those products. There's nothing out of the box there. There's nothing about your personal opinion. There's, it's only about those criteria, all right? It's super simple. And obviously I'm not talking about like problem solving, wow effect on a lot of AliExpress orders. You know those criteria, I'm, I'm not talking about those. It's more in depth than that. But it's very, very simple still. If you have those criteria down, it, you understand what a good product is, all right? What I've seen with stores is it just has to be super simple, super clean, and that's also it, no fancy thing. And I've seen really, really good looking stores which look amazing, do terrible, and other stores which are actually decent, they don't really look great, but they have a couple of specific things in place to get a good average order value, to have a good conversion rate, and they just look simple and clean, it works much better, all right? So here also, you have to be simple. Then using suppliers. If you go to AliExpress and think, all right, I'm gonna have to have this supplier for this product, this supplier for this product, and everything is good, just gonna be mixed up. No, you have to have one general agent. How we do it in the program is basically you're gonna have one agent, which is just gonna be there for you to always source the products from China and get them delivered super quickly. It takes like one to two weeks max and for him to deliver, and when it actually starts working well, then we, we send you to warehouses where everything's gonna be done like in two days or so. All right, so again, very simple. You just have an agent and he fulfills everything for you. You shouldn't use like five companies at the same time to fulfill orders. It's just one thing, all right? The, the main message here I wanna convey is everything has to be simple, 
all right? The simplicity will make everything scale. It's literally nothing else. I obviously already knew about this. However, after going through all the students who actually were really successful in the program, I really understand that this is the main thing. It amplified my opinion about this, and now I'm 100,000% sure that you need to focus on only the fundamentals, all right? The fundamentals, though, can be tough to learn if you're not doing the right things. So if you actually want me to teach you what the fundamentals are and how to properly execute everything, click the link below, sign up for a free consultation session with me personally. We're gonna see if everything is a good fit. And if yes, I'm basically gonna take you under my wing and guide you from A to Z through the whole process. So we're gonna cover everything from product selection to ad creation, to store creation, to all the Facebook stuff, to scaling, to branding, to all the suppliers, all the connections you're need, gonna need, I'm, I'm basically gonna provide to you. So if you're interested in that, click the link below, sign up for a free consultation session, and we're gonna basically find out if everything is actually a good fit. So hopefully you found value in this video, and hopefully you also stop getting this misleading information from a lot of people on YouTube, and stop thinking that everything has to be like super fancy, because you hear so many things from every single place on YouTube, you just don't know what to focus on, all right? And then you're gonna be stifled because of this incredibly high inflow of information, all right? So again, click the link below and see you there.